very mild temperatures to start the morning, but they'll drop through the next couple of hours and gradually top out in the mid 50s this afternoon. The main story today why we've issued a weather action day is because of the high winds across the plains into the foothills and continued snowfall into the mountains. Right now, last recorded wind gusts near Aurora out to the airport nearing 40 miles per hour, really windy up into Fort Collins and down south into Colorado Springs. Also blustery into the high country where snow is falling, a rain snow mix over the western slope, snow moving into the I-70 corridor and up into our northern mountains, which will continue and be heavy at times through this afternoon. So the snow picking up, the winds increasing, especially over the eastern plains. We have a lot of advisories out there this morning. No advisories for Metro Denver, but just off to the west into the foothills, Boulder, Fort Collins, Greeley, and out across all of eastern Colorado from Burlington down through Lamar, Springfield, and Colorado Springs. A high wind warning in effect until at least 5 o'clock where wind gusts could reach around 60 miles per hour. Also, snow falling for the high country is issued a winter storm warning, avalanche danger, and winter weather advisories. That'll be in effect until at least 5 o'clock this evening as well. Temperatures outside this morning were in the 40s and low 50s. High winds will continue through midday, 54 degrees by 11 o'clock in Denver. Here's what it looks like by 10 o'clock. There's that snow falling into our central mountains and down south as well from Telluride into Pagosa Springs. Very strong winds continue until at least 5 o'clock this evening, and then the snow will taper off. Winds gradually calm, and we have a pretty cool evening ahead, but it's going to be mostly sunny skies to start Saturday. A little more cloud coverage into the afternoon, and daytime highs will be slightly cooler in the high 40s with some light snow possible into our northern and central mountains to start the weekend. Now, our next storm system is set to arrive late Sunday. It'll start to bring in more heavy mountain snow once again, so we get a little bit of a break here on Sunday afternoon with daytime highs in the 50s, and then it'll be really on Monday that we'll start to see more of that moisture move into the mountains, and we'll introduce the chance for a few rain and snow showers across the plains. With this storm system, though, expect around 6 to 10 inches to accumulate into the high country in our northern and central mountains, mainly dry and windy over the eastern half of the state. By tomorrow, it's going to be mostly sunny skies, a little bit cooler in the high 40s, mild and dry on Sunday. Next chance for light snow for the Denver area will arrive on Monday, and then dry and cool Tuesday through the end of the week. Jason.